What's going on guys? Beastly Gamer here. Welcome back to the channel. This is actually a follow-up video to one of the weird and crazy stories that I did about a month or two ago about a young couple who sold their PlayStation 4 and then went to Craigslist to find someone who was selling one. They found a seller and agreed to meet him at his house to buy the PlayStation 4. The seller came outside with his PS4. The driver tried to grab the PS4 and drive off, but the seller wasn't having it, so he was pulling his PlayStation 4 back and the, the driver's girlfriend pulled out her gun, shot through her boyfriend's hand into the chest of the seller, killing him. And this was a video I did, you know, a few weeks ago, maybe a month or two ago. And I was very frustrated about it because it's unbelievable, you know, the disrespect that people have for human life. People don't value life at all. You're actually willing to kill someone for a fucking PlayStation. And thank God in this situation, justice is being served. I think that, you know... This this sentence needs to at least have been what it was, and maybe even a death penalty for both of these kids, because you only get one chance to live this life, and if you disrespect and kill someone for nothing, I think you forfeited your chance. That's my personal opinion, and I'll drop a link in the description. Man sentenced to life in prison for PlayStation killing. A 22-year-old Atlanta man has been convicted of murder and sentenced to life plus five years in prison in connection with the 2014 killing of a man over a PlayStation 4 console. Fulton County District Attorney's Office says the jury convicted Nathaniel Vivian on Wednesday of murder, felony murder, armed robbery, and other charges in the fatal shooting of 28-year-old Daniel Zietz. Prosecutors alleged that Vivian and Kayla Dixon, then 16, his girl was only 16, and she killed this guy, planned to rob Zietz during the sale arranged on Craigslist. At their meeting, Vivian tried to take the PlayStation from Zietz without paying the $280 asking price. In the scuffle, prosecutors say Dixon pulled out a handgun and fatally shot Zietz. Dixon pleaded guilty to murder in July and was sentenced to 40 years in prison. So, so the, the girlfriend, who was only 16, now 18 years old, got 40 years, and this guy got life plus five. So technically, he'll be eligible in about 25 years to get out of prison. It's one of those situations, Joe, you gotta feel for the guy's family. You know, he's out trying to sell his PlayStation 4. Probably one of the guys who feels like, man, I'm not playing this thing, I might as well get my money back. You know, and go out to sell it in front of his house and never come back in again because stupid children do stupid things. And uh, I'm just, you know, it's bittersweet. I'm happy that these two morons are going to serve this time, but ultimately, it's not going to bring the guy back. And secondly, they're going to be out one day. You know, this girl will be 60 years old. She'll be a lesbian coming out of jail. And, and she'll be uh, totally accustomed to living life there. Her life will be over. And this guy will be shit 50 something years old when he gets out of jail and he'll be totally accustomed to life there but the young man they murdered will still be dead their family will still be hurt so in my mind justice still isn't served i feel like an eye for an eye that's how i feel you know if you kill one of my children one of my family members i want you dead that's just my guy's honest truth but just be careful out there guys in this situation i'm actually happy you know that these kids got caught and that they're going to serve the time that you know people felt they needed to serve their lives are effectively over and all for nothing. All for nothing. Be safe out there. I hope you guys enjoyed this update. Uh, if you like the video, give a thumbs up and show support for the channel. Follow me on Facebook and Twitter. And tell all your friends about me. I'm the Beastly Gamer. And I'll see you guys next time. Hey,